Oh, greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to our next part in our Banjo Kazooie Let's Play. The next world is Mad Monster Machin. Hey, you like that scary voice I put on? Cow, it's the Halloween. Yeah, I know, but I'm, what? Just shut up. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Alright. So, this is Mad Monster Mansion, the sixth Wait, this is the se wait, this is the seventh level of the game. I thought it was a six. Seven. Cause, Cause there's nine worlds in the game and seven, eight, nine. Well, oh, no. Oh. <laughs> no. Just yeah. well, whatever. Who cares? So this is Mad Monster Mansion and uh, So well, since this is near the end of the game, Bottles doesn't have any more new moves for us, but uh uh, this is actually kind of a confusing level. Uh, your mate, some enemies you encounter like these annoying bats that swoop down at you. Uh, there's a skeleton guy that um you could barely see right past the uh I um, mean that little hedge maze maze over there. But uh, you, there aren't any uh. But those are really the main enemies you encounter. But uh, one reason I find, I, but this is probably the most confusing level for me actually. Oh. I remember this level. I actually remember it a lot. Yeah, this one, this one, this one kind of, this one was kind of confusing me at first. Oh, I know this is there's a stop and swap bag for this, one. I know how to get it. I think you just passed the entrance to it. Okay, so this is one of the jiggies uh, that would, you have to get. But uh, it's another. This is another one of Grunty's minions. This is Napper. Um, he knows. Uh, when you're walking towards him, so but what you want to do is that you don't want to make too much noise because uh, I think doesn't he does he attack you or does he? I think he. Well, you have. I think he. Uh, well, he has to go on high alert and you can't. Uh, well, yeah. Either way, um, he hides the jiggy from you. But the thing is, though, is that you want to be like extra careful when you're doing this because. You want know, to make sure like you don't make too much noise or he'll uh, notice you. But uh, what do you want to do is that you want to sneak up on him. But you don't walk too fast though, or like go in front of him. What do you want to do? Like, I mean, do you just? I mean, do you have to like just walk into him, or can I, can I like do I have to shoot an egg at him? I think you already failed actually, because he's awake. I think that's when he's awake. I don't think you have to shoot an egg, I think you just walk into it and try it. Oh, no, no, I thought that he wouldn't, I thought, like, this is just like a little bit of a... Is that a thing? Alright, uh... Nope, he's awake. Alright, oh, okay. You found it, get those notes while you're still at it. Okay, so, okay, so that didn't... Oh, right. look, it's another rhymer. Alright, but, okay, so apparently we can't, you can't, like... I think it will attack if you get in front of him. Yeah, if you get in front of him, it will try to, uh, squash you, but, uh, you, you can't, like, uh, can't, uh, get the egg. Uh, you can't get, like, uh, you can't egg him or anything like that. If, yeah, you, you, so you, what you gotta do is that you gotta get rid of him somehow, but, uh, not when he's, like, uh... But I think what you have to do is like I think you have to leave and then come back. I always hated these things. You have to like walk really slow because oh, you know, that, when I'm walking. Oh, there's an ecom tokum in there. Because when I like walk slow, I, I'm afraid. <laughs> uh, fire bad. Afraid yeah, but that like, was worth. It was what? it was worth it though. We got an ecom tokum from it. Because uh, when, when I walk, I have to walk really slow. I'm afraid I'm gonna slip and I'm gonna start running. Oh, and they waste them up. Yeah. Uh, like, oh man, I hope, I really hope that I don't. No, wait, wait, wait. Up wait, can we just like, no, I think we have to leave and then come back, and you know? I think. Or have to step on the carpet, I think. No. I think you have to go completely gone. Yeah, I think you have to leave, and then, but you can't like, but you gotta make sure you don't.
Yeah, he's asleep now. So what you gotta do is that you have to sneak. Did it, did it wake him up? Do this awake now. Yeah. Oh yeah, this this one's kind of annoying. You have to sneak really lightly. Yeah, you got you got to do it like you, you got to do it like sneak. You have to sneak perfectly for that one because as soon as you step on the wooden and like if you step as soon as you step in the wooden area and you're not like and you're not like sneaking like that, you have to be in this sneaking pose. No. No, 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 no. I think what you have to do is that uh, chandelier up there. I'm thinking maybe you could drop. No. All right. No. Uh, that's something you gotta do later. But we're not gonna. Yeah. This one. This one of the ones that really got get, got on my nerves a little bit. Um. Wait a second. I remember something. I think you picked the glass out. Yep. Yeah. But I don't think it really. Yeah. It puts you up here though. Oh gee, it's just okay. That was right. yeah. That's one of those skeleton guys. It's pretty much just the Banjo Kazooie version of a dry bones. You know, you defeat him and you, he just falls apart, but he comes back together. Ooh, can we go in that uh Grunty painting? I don't know. I, I don't think I can kill that one. Okay, if it, if we can, it's pretty much be like uh, Super Mario 64. It'll take us to Holy World. No. Look at these paintings you can't go inside. No. Can't we just destroy the painting or something? No, I don't think destroying them does anything. Well, I, I just don't like seeing Grunty's face in the wall. But I think we can't. I don't think you can. Oh, wait, try hopping on that painting frame. This one? Yeah. Uh, no, no, but I think. Wait, can you kill? Oh yeah, you can kill him. Okay. I don't think, but I, I didn't think you'd go in it though. Okay. Uh. Do you guys know where to stop the swap bag is? No. All right. Uh, was it somewhere around here? Yeah. I think it's around the back of the house. Oh, this thing down here? Yeah. Okay. Okay, well, Christmas says there's another stop and swap. Okay, uh, this is another- this is a, another enemy. I don't think you can kill these guys, though. You can kill them with one away. Oh, yeah, that's Pretty right. much anything you can kill with them. No, never mind. Right, come on, Wonder Wing, you were working earlier before. Okay. There we go. Okay. I mean, before I was working when I didn't need it, and you know, there's like, you know, moment of, you know, moment of truth, and then, you know, this not work. Alright, I hear a Jinjo in here. There you go. Alright, there's a Jiggy. And uh, there's another. Uh, Mumbo's also in this level too. Uh. Oh yeah, here's the stop and swap egg. Hey, whoop, whoopee! Okay. Fanfare hey, over. Okay, let's. Oh, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, I think. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I think this is the last level uh, where Mumbles in. Where like. No. Uh, he's in Rusty Bucket Bay. I, I no, thought... he's in Click Clock Wood. No, yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. He has. He... Oh well, no. I thought because he's not in one like one of the seasons. I mean. Oh okay. So, yeah. Scratch said. Um. Well, technically, well in Click Clock Wood, he's only there for a certain season, but um for uh this level, you know. But for Click Clock Wood is like the last real level, but oh, he's scared me like that. 
Well, this is, like, yeah, I think... Well, yeah, okay, yeah. I really hate these guys. This, uh, Man Monster Mansion will take you well. I mean, compared to like, um, uh, Rusty Bucket Bay is actually kind of quick. It's hard. Yeah, I mean, yeah, Rusty Bucket Bay is a lot faster than like most other worlds, but it's still, I mean, it's still, it's still gonna take you a while though. And it's, I mean, Click Clock Wood is just kind yeah, of annoying. Yeah, Click Clock Wood is kind of annoying. I mean, compared to the fact that you're gonna have to like, the host, uh, like, you have to go. Um, so like, um, certain seasons to get certain jiggies, and like sometimes you need to be like uh, you have to have Mumble transform you into like a certain one, and you gotta go uh, make it this certain season to do this and stuff like that. It kind of gets annoying. I mean, but uh, the next world, Rusty Bucket Bay, actually won't take that long I think, if I remember. I mean, it's, it is really hard though. I mean, and then again, I mean, this is kind of a. Uh, and this level is not that hard. I mean, it's kind of confusing trying to figure out where everything is. Especially when you gotta deal with, like, the annoying enemies like these guys. Uh, I think. No, we can't kill the, um, tentacle monster. The water in this area did something, but it doesn't. I gotta put the water in Uh, you're thinking of, uh, Rusty Bucket Bay's water? Yeah, I might be. Oh, you mean like? Oh, well, I actually forgot what, what that water is. I think it's polluted water. Polluted water. So is that why you can't breathe? Is that why? Is that why you can't breathe in the surface in the water? Yeah, I think that's what it is. I think it's because it's polluted water. But I think this water is fine to go on. That kind of doesn't make any sense. Man, weird. Yeah. Surprised we're just running around and I kind of forgot where. All right. Oh yeah, this is the lock. There we go. Oh yeah, here's another here's another annoying enemy. Is it this one? Nope. Well, it's um one of these uh some of these tombstones will actually Uh who's this guy? Yep, the bag is in this hole. Alright. Hey, take my eggs, buddy. Say thank you, or oh yeah, here's another annoying enemy. These tombstones, uh, random tombstones, usually like, get up and try to chase after you. That's uh, Yeah, what, what was that all about? I, I, I put A's in it. And you like say? They say like screw you. No, I think he said thank you, but I, I thought I saw some like sprout up when I turned the camera. Like, I just turned the camera for like one measly second, and all of a sudden, I, I could have sworn I saw something like pop up for a second in it. Thank you. Yeah, I, 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 I'm sure it's thank you. I, I'm almost certain that, that does not. To me, that does not sound like thank you. Well, I mean, the, I mean the way you hear it, I mean, yeah, it might not sound like thank you, but I, yeah.
This is not one of those annoying tombstones I know is back here. Just one of you is gonna pop up. Watch on it. Oh. I think it's the darker color ones that pop up, I think. Oh, here, I hear I hear a beehive somewhere. I was about to say, wait, a bee? I thought that was. I thought that was a click clock wood, and then I remembered. Oh. Yeah. And for, and for helping, we got a jiggy. Uh, back here, maybe? If you poop eggs to a flower pot, it will give you gold. No, I think we're right here. That beehive is probably in the maze. Oh. Ah, oh, jeez. Can we go in here yet? All right. No. I think you have to like climb on top of the tombstone to go up there. No. Alright, yeah, this is the closest we can Oh, town charge. Okay. A lot of notes up here. Mm, Alright, oh yeah, there's mumble. Oh. Oh. oh, I didn't notice mumble was right over there. Oh, oh, he's. Circle. Alright, let's see, uh. There's something else. I mean, she's back over there in the hedge maze. Yeah, it's kind of a small area. You mostly, you'll mostly, be, you'll mostly be going inside for. Uh, you'll mostly be like in, in, in like mostly inside areas. Like in here, or well, I guess it takes it to the top. Of it. Wow, this reminds me of that one place. Alright, hop up here and it's another jiggy. Alright, let's get a good view of this, okay. And the maze. There's a ginjo down there. Hey, look at me, I'm defying the, the rules of the maze. Oh. They've been funny if that clone took you out. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah. What was that what you were saying? <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say... Right, here he is. I was about to say I'm going to laugh if you just fall off. You know, I was about to say that, like, you know, it's like... Yeah, those ghosts were about to knock me off the, the, the top, and I was like... Uh, hey, what are you, you, what are you doing cheating? Uh, we don't allow cheaters in this maze. We just came through a, a different. Uh, we just came from the other end. Yeah, we basically just went in a full circle. Well, no, we still gotta go. We gotta still gotta go talk to Mumble so we can 
turns into a pumpkin. Yeah, that's his lowest transformation. Yeah, cool, isn't it, pumpkin? Well, I mean, it's supposed to fit in with this Halloween theme, so yeah, pumpkin. Alright. Alright, well, um. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think you can go in here through. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's what you were talking about earlier, like one of those things we can go in. Alright, come back out. You know, these things always go a harder head when I played this game. But they're really just uh, reskins of these guys with the camera. Yeah, they're pretty much, they're pretty much just a reskin into me. Uh. Is that it? Yeah, that's that's that that was it. Just a bunch of notes and well, there there were no notes. Just a bunch of eggs and feathers. Okay, well that's uh, like seemed pointless. I mean, you know, I was thinking maybe there'd be like a, maybe some. I just Woo! thought there'd be some more interesting in here. Like a jiggy. Yeah. All right. Well. Oof. Well, I think this. I think that's all for now. Um. So until the next episode, I'm Kelvin. I'm Christopher. And we'll see you in the next part of our Banjo Kazooie Let's Play where we um, continue through Mad Monster Mansion. So until then, see you next time. <laughs>